In this Blender tutorial I will show you how to render a 3D scene with a low sampling rate that doesn't have a grainy noise in the final image. Other tutorials can be found in my playlists. OK, well I've set this scene up um, to actually make a grainy image if you like. Um, I've done this in Cycles Render and um, at the standard sort of setup that you get with a blender on the sampling rate which is somewhere along here the preview is 32 um, whatever the 32 stands for so what I've actually done is I've taken the render rate down this is the one at the top this is in section the section here is sampling so the render rate samples is 32 I think it's something like 100 and something I can't remember what it is when uh, you actually go into the default settings so this should render roughly the same as this um, which as you can see is going to be pretty grainy so I'm just going to go ahead and just render it just to show you what it looks like I probably won't leave it run all the way through so if I left click on the render button you can see that this is starting to look pretty grainy here and this is what the image will look like set at 32 uh, render samples of 32 ok well I'll just stop this here now, there's a real easy way to actually get rid of this problem now on newer blenders top right of the screen to the right of the camera your render button there's your render layers button left click on this and then left click on deionizing don't worry about changing these settings um, it gets a bit complicated and it can throw things out so for just a quick tutorial I'm not going to bother with changing any of these settings just place a tick in the deionizing box go back up to your render button and then render your image again and what you'll find is this it actually starts taking away the grain you get a sort of double um, sample over it um, and what I'll do I think is I'll like let this one go through um, and render and come back to it when it's finished ok well that's finished rendering now and at a uh, render rate of 32 samples um, I haven't changed anything I think you'll probably agree that that is a vast improvement on the original um, render that I did without using the deionizing button um, I'm not going to go into anything else I assume you've got to this stage already of rendering and saving an image and want to know how to get rid of the grain um, I think if I had to render this and remove all of the sort of noise that was in this uh, image I'd probably have to take the samples up to at least 500 the uh, render rate um, I think that's pretty impressive really so hopefully that's helped somebody thank you for watching cheers